It marks a special day as we celebrate the substantial completion of three, and I'll be big enough to say, major sections of US 290, and they get make more majors to move in, but these are very important to us. Three of the 13 projects, the corridor is worth about a $1.3 billion, and we're glad that we've got some of it finished. While we celebrate this milestone, it's the first of many openings we're going to have. These three segments from the Harris Waller County line total 11 miles, almost a third of the 38 mile corridor that we have here. Together, they cross about $130 million, that was the construction cost, and that is about 10% of the overall $1.3 billion price tag for our corridor. Uh, and so this is the light at the end of the tunnel for us. You know, it's been a long journey uh, going all the way down to the 610 e exchange. Uh, the journey is ongoing, but we're nearing the end. I just want to say thank you to all the fine folks in, at the state who worked on this project. And on behalf of the citizens of Water County, Montgomery County, and, and I would say the state of Texas, I, I just want to say thank you. I greatly appreciate the good effort and look forward to seeing the balance of this uh, section completed. It, it is indeed an important I think uh, long overdue. And when you mention the fact that the contracts were let on this project in 2015, and we're standing here in 2018, um, is quite frankly an amazing accomplishment. And it's it's a testament to everyone that has been involved with this project. Quincy, your staff, the Transportation Commission, Williams Brothers Construction, uh, the Texas Legislature. Uh, Representative Oliverson and, and Representative Bell and, and the, the, the great people in the state of Texas that decided over the last few years to make mobility and transportation a priority. So the 290 improvement that we uh, celebrate today is going to position the city of Waller to continue our growth and to continue to build the quality of life that our citizens all deserve and desire. So today I just want to say uh, thank you to the taxpayers and thank you to TechStock. For truly being an able to economic, help economic development in this area, I think that together we will really make this vision come to reality. Once again, thank you for having us. Hey,